Hey guys, it's Wiz here. Yesterday I was at Eurogamer in Birmingham in the UK. Uh, it was a long train journey, about three hours total, but when we got there, the first game we headed to first was Star Wars Battlefront. This was the game I wanted to play the most. And we queued up for about an hour to play the co-op survival mode on Tatooine. Unfortunately, we didn't get to play the multiplayer mode because the queue time for that was two hours, so we just tried to prioritize our games a bit. But this uh, game mode was really fun. We did manage to finish all six waves. And I do like the arcade feel of it because uh, it's just a lot more fun and you've got the star cards there. But it's also really challenging as well, so you have to use a lot of teamwork to get the job done. It's actually pretty hard at times. I'm really excited for this game, guys, so expect to see Star Wars Battlefront on my channel when it comes out. Next, we headed over to Need for Speed. It was a long queue. They only had eight consoles set up. So the wait time for this, we actually waited for nearly eight, two hours and a half to play this game. It was a huge queue. So we started playing, we did a sprint race, uh, then we got to drive around, we had to drift and things to get points, get your rep up. And then the person at the end who gets the most points got a t-shirt. Um, and funnily enough, that was my friend. My friend Mick got himself a Need for Speed t-shirt, so congrats to him. Uh, I didn't do so well. He got like something like 98,000 points. I think I was something like 59,000. But yeah, definitely looking forward to Need for Speed when it comes out. Then we headed over to get some merchandise. We thought we might as well get some merchandise while we were there. Then we headed over to the uh, Ubisoft area, which was all closed off, and there was all the Ubisoft games there. There was so many to choose from. We tried to get into the division. Unfortunately, they shut the queue because, yeah, again, it was about a two-hour wait, and there wouldn't have been enough time before the end of the show for us to play the division. I did, however, get to play Assassin's Creed Syndicate, and uh, we, we got in there pretty much straight away. We got taken from the back of the queue. We got straight in there and played uh, this mission on screen now. It's really, really fun. I'm actually really looking forward to this. And I love the fact that it's in London. Uh, a lot of people think that Assassin's Creed becoming kind of stale now. Uh, it is, but it's really nice to see London. It's like a really fresh location, a really well-known location. And I think it's going to bring a lot of nice variety to the, to the Assassin's Creed universe. And I love the fact there's two characters, you know, Jacob and Evie, who you can play as. Also from the Vanos Gaming recording crew, uh, Terrorizer was there. Brian was up on stage playing some games and having fun, so that was cool to see him. Yeah. Anyway guys, that's all from me. I hope you enjoyed this short highlights video of Eurogamer. I've got so many great games coming up for you guys, so make sure you stick tuned on the channel for a great gameplay coming your way real soon. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm Hospital Wiz, and I'll speak to you guys later on.